She's a lady. Hey guys, thanks for coming back to my channel this week. This week we are going to have an at-home spa day. This is probably a little different for everybody. This is how I do my at-home spa day. My dude had to work today, so I'm just at home. But I'm a lonely today. It's very rare that he is working when I am not. Usually we have the same schedule, but not today. So it's an at-home spa day for me. We have all sorts of stuff. We've got fancy water. We got bath bombs. Ooh, we have this awesome face mask and I love it. You mix it with some organic apple cider vinegar. I got my soothing lip balm. I got some scrub. It's just a simple scrub I made with coconut oil, sugar, and essential oils. Oh, this. You ever seen one of these? They're pretty cool. They're really fun. It's a head massager. Admittedly, it's a lot better when somebody else is doing this to you because it's kind of like I know when I'm pressing down and so the element of surprise is non-existent. If you guys have one of these and you know, if somebody does it to you, it feels a lot different than you doing it to yourself. But it's still really nice. Massaged. I'm gonna do my face mask first. And I do my face mask always before my bath and I don't sit in the bath with it on because the heat and the humidity from my hot bath water makes it so it doesn't dry as quick and it takes a decent amount of time to dry anyway like 15 to 20 minutes and usually I would just you know washing my face I just use a regular headband but this is a spa day so I'm using a headscarf so I'm gonna be pretty and fancy Mm. Fancy. Before I put the mask on, I'm going to use my sugar scrub and just scrub my lips and my face. With this, all you do is mix equal parts of this to this. For me, in just doing one face, I use a tablespoon of this and a tablespoon of this. Oh man, I forgot. It's always best to put on chapstick before you do this in case you do get any around your mouth. She's a lady. And you'll see like right now you could tell it's like super wet and gloopy. Um, it'll start to dry and crack and I'll look like Killer Croc. Ah. I don't care if you don't know who Killer Croc is. If you do though, you one of the cool ones. So while we are waiting for the face mask to dry, we're gonna be playing some Fallout New Vegas. Okay, so as you can see, this is really, really dry now. I told you it looks like Killer Croc. I can barely even move my mouth. It's just pulling everything super tight. I just take my washcloth, I get it wet with some water. And I'm just trying to soften this back up so it'll peel off my face. You see? It starts to come off. My face is always bright red after I do this. We have a little bit of this oil mixture left. What I just put on my face is, I think a men's beard care product. I don't know. It's from a company, Jack Black. What is it? Oh, it just says nourishing oil. But it's got argon oil in it, grapeseed oil, I, a whole bunch. All right, so we got that on our face. I'm gonna follow it up with some of my honey body butter. Now that my face is done, I'm gonna go ahead and get my bath water ready. This one has gold in it. I'm gonna jump in. Mm, it's cold on my back. It's starting. Look, it gave me sparkles. Oh, no sparkles. Solid, solid reading material. 
And like honestly, people are always like, oh, you need to read with pictures. Yes, but you get so sucked into the story. They're great stories. You see the pictures, but you don't really see the pictures. All right, finished up my nice spa bath. Got my cozy robe on. Lotionized after the bath, because that's definitely a, a must for me. I get really dry skin. <laughs> Feeling really relaxed, really pampered. And now I'm just gonna go hang out and finish playing some more Fallout. It's what I wanna do. I'm gonna get to figure out dinner, but we'll worry about that later. If you like this week's video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, please and hit that notification bell. You'll be notified every time I put up a new video. Until next week, guys, just keep marching to the beat of your own drum.